You hear that music? That's my dad. Am I gonna get copyrighted for this? Probably, but that's okay. I'm just gonna keep rolling with it. Um, this dude's awesome, right? Yeah. I'm gonna get my goal for this video. This right here. This, this, that's it. I'm not even gonna look at anything else. What should I put here? I mean, honestly, I don't even know. 20 minutes later. A centipede, honestly. Fuck it. Yeah, let's get a centipede up in this bitch. Draw some, some little circles for the centipede. Are you guys more of a stingray or a manatee kind of person? Because honestly, I think manatees are a little bit cooler than stingrays. Like stingrays are cool and all, but like they're small and like, actually stingrays though, they'd be jumping out of the water to me. And I think that's actually pretty fucking cool. So maybe stingrays are cooler, but nah, but stingrays killed my boy. So and by my boy, I mean, oh my God, I can't remember his name, but the Australian dude that, <laughs> that did those like, and like an old planet and shit like that the crocodile hunter the crocodile dundee or not obviously not crocodile dundee I'm, i was just it was just the first thing that came to my mind when i say crocodile dude uh wow i'm so mad i can't think of his name right now i'll probably edit it in the video like right now of me saying it really aggressively toward myself steve Irwin, you fuck yeah look at the centipede i mean honestly centipedes are pretty easy to draw but like they fucking they hit, they hit hard sometimes they, they add that little like extra value of like Ugh, i don't want it to be there I mean, actually, I wouldn't mind being here. But that's because I literally designed this myself. <laughs> this world. And I know how it works in my head. So, like, basically, I'm connecting this to a couple other drawings that I'll flash here. Bam! 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 Okay, cool. Those three. Um, no those are three shit. that I've worked on that are a part of this hellscape world. And my end goal with this is to be able to connect them all into one gigantic mural. Cause I want to sh show like as much of this world as I can that I've created in my head. This ends up being unhealthy for me and I end up going schizophrenic and thinking that they're real and they're talking to me. Yeah, that'd be fun. <laughs> mm, what else? Let's see. Let's get a... Mm, I know. Cause why not? I'm like, why did you say why not but not say anything else, bro? Cause you'll see. You probably already see what this is gonna be. Yeah. Yep, you're probably right. Are you right? It's like kind of funny that penises look like mushrooms. Um, and it's gonna be coming out of a little hole like this. It's a freaking glory hole, bro. Oh, it's gonna have a fucking bush coming out of this bitch right here like this. <laughs> I'm not gonna do all the lines because I'm gonna go in color, but yeah. That's gonna be awesome. Uh, <laughs> and then we get this part. Let me get something right here, actually. The hard part about this is that it's all on a wall. So it's like, what can stick to a wall? Hmm, actually, let me go. I don't wanna put too many. Yes, I do. Actually, I do. There's mad people living in this fucking column. Oh, buddy, buddy. <laughs> Budget. Oh, yeah, I was gonna add a window here. Let me just do this real quick before I forget. Up. I don't want to do it like this. I want to do it like this. This kind of window. Okay, also, if you guys are into like scary stories and shit like that, y'all need to check out Mr. Creepypasta. He's the GOAT, okay? I don't care what anyone else says. He's my absolute favorite, and I want everyone to support him because I think he's awesome. And I think he deserves all the success in the world through telling scary stories. Cause he's gotten me through some tough times with just his voice. It's a pretty big deal to me. But it's okay. I understand if you don't want to check him out. I mean, I don't understand because you're just you're probably just a pussy and can't handle scary stories or something. Waka waka. What is that? It's a bed. What? Bed? Oh, smiley face. Hi, smiley face. Oh, you guys like this one? No, you don't. Just kidding. We're back to this. I don't want to get distracted. <laughs> like actually. Like actually. Ooh, ooh, yes, I know exactly what I want to put here. More eyes. Like
basically what's gonna happen is this motherfucker has a lot of motherfucking eyes and some of them are different than others and oh one thing i think is important for me to mention right now is there is a difference between these eyes and these eyes like so this means that they still have a soul that can be put back into a, a real body and like have a real life again not this um in between place this hellscape but if it has an x like a plus sign like that that means that the soul is damned for good or unless to make a heroic journey and try to get to <gasps> bam this place right here yeah so you see where it says um come in for another life well you can make the journey to that location and either you can get into that elevator or you see the guy sitting yeah um you'll see him go up well he wants but yeah he'll go up and have a new life but then you also see that little slide right there i don't know if you can tell that's a slide but it's a slide you see a person sliding down they are getting pushed into this river bodies which you see here on the wall right here um this is part of it and it's there's gonna be just connecting rivers but the main that's one of the sources of them they get pushed into that the river starts before then though but if they get rejected, they get this mark and they go in there. Some people fall into the river anyway. You'll notice that all of these have, like this guy has, this guy could be returned if he gets out of this river. But if not, this river is kind of like, you're fucked if you're in this river. But uh, yeah, so that's that's what, the, that's what the meaning of these eyes are. Like you'll notice some people, like this guy, if you have slit eyes like this, uh, he's, he's a powerful wizard, so he can kind of sift through whatever reality he feels he needs to be in at that moment. Uh, it takes energy though, so he's not, you know, he's not like super powerful, but when he has this energy built up, he is able to perform, you know, magic, wizardry. He's a little bit, he's more powerful than Ice King from Adventure Time, I'll put it that way. Um, he's probably, he's probably just as psychotic though. He also has, um, he's gonna have a pet. He's like these sick like fairies, but these fairies are just eyes with wings. Like this. And he's looking at this motherfucker like, oh yeah, my lord. I want that sweet coochie that you got. And I'm just gonna do the bottom row of these wings because I wanna go back with this in pen and it's easier to not draw over pencil with the pen that I use. It's like a pen marker. Um, I don't actually I don't even have to make it that nice because I'm gonna erase this and go over it. But this is just so I know what's gonna be there and I don't forget. Um, I will go back to that, but like I said, today, this is today's goal. Get this these two sections right here done. And that'll probably be today's video also. I mean, it's not gonna be a long one. Uh, it's gonna be split into a lot of different parts, but it's because I don't wanna rush it. I wanna like, I want to take care of everything that I'm putting in here. Like, I want something crawling around right here. There you go. Little, little booty cheek. Um. Yeah. Other detail after, and then let's see. Oh, music stopped. Oh my god. Tell me someone's gonna end. And now some music accompanied by me. That's gonna be uh, for JJ to match the penis. Okay, so like, um, boom, it is, these two are outlined, and now I'm just gonna get some color. Let's see what color I'm gonna get today. Um, I'm gonna actually close my eyes and whatever color I pick is gonna be the color of that eyeball thing. I'm not looking, I don't know you guys are, but I'm not looking, my eyes are looking the other way. I'm actually looking at my, my thick, my thick ball with this thick, thick. I'm not even gonna look, I'm gonna show you what I'm looking at first. This dude, look at this nice, man. look at this nice, beep, beep. Oh, this color. What is this? Okay, cool. Oh, his finger just came off. I'm sorry, bro. Oh, my, also, my boy Thomas. He drew an upside down version over there. What? Okay, let's get this fucking shit colored. A 
Sorry, I was, I was doing a whip it. <laughs> okay, so I've heard that if you do a whip it while you're tripping on acid, that shit breaks into like a fractal dimension, like like the mirror dimension from Doctor Strange. And I low-key want to find out, <laughs> but I'm not trying to fuck around. <laughs> yeah, no thanks. Because I have already dabbled with acid and a dab. I dabbled, I didn't even mean to, that was pun not intended. Uh, and that was fucking insane. Like, I saw these, these two blocks, one was blue, one was red, and they just kind of like f fell over on like towards me. And then, but other than that, it was like just like a white space behind them. It, almost like the nothingness that Squidward was in, in the episode where he was trying to try and to play his clarinet out without being bothered by Spongebob. And once those two fell, it like got pushed back and then there was four of them. And then those four closed into each other and then it would turn into 16 and exponentially grew like that. And I was like, oh my God, this is, this is too much for me right now. So I opened my eyes and everything looked like a pastel painting, just an oil painting, sorry, not pastel, an oil painting just painted before my eyes and animated in real time. Like I could see the bristles of the paintbrush, like the strokes that were taken. It felt so surreal and overwhelming. And that was only my second acid trip. So yeah, that's... That's how that went. I don't know if you noticed, but I like making people green in this world. For what reason? I do not know. But yeah. I don't know just fix that up, but off camera because I like it like that. Let me just go like. Okay, so I do like this one because it makes the color a little more solid. Yeah, a nice bit of shadowing. Gotta make sure you get nice shadowing on his balls. Just like this. Okay. Just like just like that. Bam, look at that. See, that's done. Now I'm gonna go back to this one though. So this one's gonna be like. Yeah, let's do it. Shake it in. Yeah, I'm gonna do this already. I'm gonna do this go over and make this black with black paint later. Bam. All right, now I gotta cut those fucking eyes in. And the eyes are gonna get colored in, like, it, for some reason. Watch this fool. I'm about to, I'm about to scare this motherfucker. <laughs> he has no idea. He's not gonna see me. I swear to, what the fuck, do you see that? I thought I just saw someone run across the yard. Can't see. Whatever. Fucking pussy. Hmm, weird. I'm just gonna leave that there. Uh, get back to coloring these eyes. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. I don't want to show him on camera because he's a little pussy. Watch this. Uh, I'm gonna go pink. Fuck it. I mean, actually, I want to do the eyes with, uh, well, with paint. But yeah, let me get the colors in right. This one's gonna be blue. There you go. Bam. Yummy, yummy. And those, you know, I like to do the little skin tone for those guys, make it look a little, little yummy, yummy. Oh, oh yeah. Actually, that works. I could do. It. I, could, I could work with this. Bam, look at that. Mm. That freaking makes it look so goddamn beautiful. Mm, mm, mm. Look at this vagina. It's vagina time. Now right, let's get this border going though. So I want to know what space I have to work with. Bam. Look at that shit. Is it a good vagina? Yes, and it's nice and tight. It's modeled after my own, actually. I know you guys think I might have a penis, but I don't. Alright, let's get this nice little pink going on. It's okay. 
bam, that shit looks kind of bad. I'll fix it with paint though, just not right now. I will fix that with paint. Um, but I want to get this motherfucker is this color. It's like a like a tan kind of shit. Pretty prominent veins. You know, like that. Okay, and it's a little irritated on the rim of his dick because he just pushed through rock, so it's gonna be a little red right there. Shit, outline, motherfucker. Bam. P-E-N-I-S, yeah. Mm, fuck. I gotta fix that with paint too. The more I mess up with this, the more I gotta do paint. So let me move on to this for now. It's time for another public service announcement. Oh my god, whispering though is actually like one of my biggest pet peeves. Like that shit pisses, like, doesn't piss, it just hurts to hear someone whisper in my ear. Damn, if whispering isn't fucking atrocious. All right, that's what we're working with. Um, what the fuck? Damn, look at that boy. No buoy. Okay, but the vans, I'm sorry. Awesome. Oh my gosh, I'm not wearing a hat. I forgot. Yeah, but you're gonna see that color in three? Mm -hmm. Okay, so now I got this motherfucker drawn in. I just gotta add shading, just, just the color. I just want to show you the color and also beep beep. Um, I don't know if you can't tell, but there's actually white paint right there that you're using for cum, but no. I'm gonna wait until I get it all colored in before I really make that stand out. But I'm um, just gonna color this, yeah, I'm gonna color this guy in, and then I think I'm gonna leave these two squares good, and then I'm gonna color them in with the color that I want to, so that this is gonna be done, done, and then I can move on to the next stage. I'll probably work on this eye next after, but that'll be the next video. This video is just this, like I said. So just so you keep it, um, yeah, I started coloring this in with gray, and I said I'm going to do like a alternating, <coughs> bro, I was saying, I'm going to do uh, an alternating color, so this one's going to be this color, like this, and then this one will be this color, and then I'll do that with like the whole wall to give it more contrast. Um, I'm scared to look, oh god. Jesus Christ, I'm so sorry. I will not make you look at myself again. Just kidding, you keep looking at me because I'm a YouTuber now, so you have to get used to my face and also my art because that's not going anywhere until I die. Yeah. <laughs> I think the sharpened is broken because whenever I put it in, it just, and I twist it a couple times, it just turns to, to a different color. Like, look. See? Like, what the fuck? Whatever. I really don't understand what's going on but whatever so this is basically what it's gonna look like it's gonna look like this and i'll start adding shadow and then i'll show you oh i forgot that i'm glad i started recording except for missed that part i mean i would have got it anyway but like still um but yeah this is what the difference is gonna look like and i'm gonna add shadow now oh my god you should watch this this is really good you should listen to this um okay i just want to show you the power of this fucking mark there so that's gonna stay there for now this is it for 
today. You might see a change be before the next video because I'm I'm already actually I already see stuff I'm gonna change. I'll do that before I finish the video. But you probably see it change even more before the next video. I mean during the next video because I like to add things sometimes. Just to add more depth to it. No. Okay. Bam. Look at that. Those two pieces are done. Now I just have quite a bit more to do. This one will probably be next video will probably be this and the eye. This actually the next video is just gonna be this area right here. Cause I'm gonna add stuff all around there. But yeah, next video, bam. This video, done. That video. Um I I also did this. I mean, you know, kinda of showed it last time, but just so you get a better look at it. But yeah, okay. Um that's what we just expect the next video, so just stay keep watching, I guess. I'm gonna freaking try to get these puppies out at least once a day. I mean that's a lot. I'm probably one to one today, maybe like three times a week or something like that. I don't know. We'll see. Um but yeah, I hope you guys liked this and I enjoyed this actually, so just gotta just gotta keep loving. I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, I guess. I guess I should say I was saying that. Subscribe. If you ain't no bitch.